The Senate Finance Committee's top Democrat wants a deep dive into a 10-year-old real estate sale President Trump's company made to a Kremlin tea oligarch. Sen. Ron Wyden has requested the Treasury Department fork over all documents related to the July 2008 sale of Maison de la Mite, a Palm Beach estate purchased by former fertilizer King Dmitry Rybolovlev. Wyden Dor, in a letter dated Friday and obtained by CNN, says the president was in dire financial straits at the time and sold it for $30 million less than its appraised value. In the context of the president's then precarious financial position, I believe that the Palm Beach property sale warrants further scrutiny, Wyden wrote to Treasury Secretary Steve. Newton, it is imperative that Congress follow the money and conduct a thorough investigation into any potential money laundering or other illicit financial dealings between the president, his associates and Russia. Trump scooped up the Western Florida estate out of bankruptcy in 2004 for roughly $41.4 million, and sold it to Rybar Lovelef four years later for about $95 million. Related people reportedly interviewed in Robert Mueller's Russia probe U.S. Attorney General Jeff Sessions' photo by Chip Samoda Villager T images former FBI Director James Comey Reuters Jonathan Ernst former White House Chief of Staff Reince Priebus Reuters Joshua Roberts former White House Press Secretary Sean Spicer Reuters Gavin Lamarck White House Director of Strategic Communications Hope Hicks photo by Jabin Botsford The Washington Post via Getty images Trump advisor Stephen Miller Reuters Gavin Lamarck President Trump's son-in-law and senior advisor Jared Kushner B. Brendan Smilov Skip Getty images is Don McGahn, general counsel for the Trump transition team photo by Drew Anger Getty Images Christopher Steele, the former MI6 agent who compiled the reported Trump dossier photo by Victoria Jones per images via Getty Images Sam Clovis, a former member of the Trump campaign photo by Win McNamee Getty Images The Tycoon, a longtime ally of Russian President Vladimir Putin, never D in the home, since dividing the 6.3-acre estate into three separate parcels. At least one sold for $34.34 million, with the other closing at $37 million, according to an October article in the South Florida Business Journal. The 2008 transaction is one of several potential connections with Russia. Special counsel Robert Mueller is looking at in his Russia probe, Bloomberg reported last summer. The president acknowledged on the campaign trail that the Palm Beach estate was one of his few financial associations with the Russian national. Questions were raised about their associations last year, when Rybolovlev's yacht was anchored close to one owned by Robert Mercer, a well-known Trump backer. And his jet was spotted parked next to Trump's plane twice in during the campaign, first in North Carolina, then Las Vegas. But a spokesman downplayed the proximity as nothing but a coincidence when McClatchy reported the sightings last year. Trump has maintained he never met Rybolovlev, and that a broker represented the Russian oligarch during the sale. Wyden is able to request the documents because of his role as ranking member of the Senate Finance Committee, CNN noted, although his colleagues across the aisle don't want to look into Trump's financial dealings. More from New York Daily News President Trump reportedly lied about how much he paid for Melania Trump's engagement ring Attorney General Jeff Sessions says patients should take OTC medicines and tough it out President Trump calls Faith Central to American Life at National Prayer Breakfast.